And does anybody know else know how notice how I talk and just like <laughs> Does anybody else have a waddle? <laughs> no matter what I do, I still have a waddle. Alright, anyway, I'll be back. It is Sunday morning. I don't know what time it is. Hold on a second. About 10.08 a.m. I was going to crimp my hair and stuff today. But you know what? We're going out to run errands and I just don't feel like it. So it's not happening. <laughs> anyway, we've got kind of a laundry list of errands to run today. And we want to start taking down the Christmas decorations today. Bob has tomorrow off. So if we don't get it all done today, we can do some tomorrow. Uh... But it's kind of a busy-ish week. I'm still doing physical therapy for my knee. I've got to get dad at the airport one day this week. I need to pick up my new custom orthotics, all the things for the things. We're starting a couple of new things over in the life of art and self-expression. I've got journal stuff I need to work on. See, it's all laid out over there. I also have a couple of daily art videos I want to film. I don't think I'm going to call them tutorials, more of like this is what I do, I encourage you to do what you do, kind of. I don't know what else to call it. And yes, it's the... Anyway, I'm going to get on the internet. I forgot to post one picture last night, so I'm going to do that in the Facebook art groups, uh, art group, A Life of Art and Self-Expression. And take care of that this morning. Well, Bob, Bob takes a shower. I'm not completely awake, can you tell? <laughs> Good morning, everybody. It's Monday morning, January 3rd, 9.37 a.m. Don't get excited, we're in front of the computer. Um, yes, I'm still in my pajamas. Um, our goal today is to get the outdoor Christmas decor down. Um, but before we do that, Bob and I are both going to, obviously, I'm up here, we're checking on computers. I'm going to download vlog footage from last week, write all this week's social media posts. We're going to start something new over in a life of art and self-expression for this year and see how that goes. And all of those things. And then if I have time later this afternoon, I want to film a couple of daily drawing videos um, fast forwards of which will be here on the public channel talking, me blathering on about what I'm doing will be over on the Patreon channel. Um, I'm, I might decorate a couple of sketchbooks for February early so that you all can see how I do that. Um, yeah, like all those things. I've had all my coffee, I swear. I'm yeah, but anyway. Uh, okay, so Bob and I both upgraded our um, computers to the next version of operating systems and kind of held our breath while we were doing it, doing it. His computer's a bit newer than my desktop, but you never know with these things. Both came out fine. Thank goodness. Anyway, so that's done. We also got all the Christmas decorations down. Yay! And put away. And put away. Okay. Sort of. The outside ones are drying in the garage. We're going to go for a walk now while it's not doing much raining before it starts again. Because we're supposed to have a whole entire week or more of just rain, 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 rain. Rain, 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 rain. Anyway, we're going to maybe try to find a new way to walk, but... Um, I think we've done them all already, so I'm not sure how that's going to work out, but we'll see. I'll be we back. haven't told you <laughs> the excitement in the house. We've been noticing for a couple of months that our internet router seems to, gateway thing seems to sort of have a mind of its own. I heard a noise. Um, it has these periodic bouts of very iffy connections. A few times in the last few months, we've had to reboot it, and that seems to fix it temporarily. We finally called the internet provider last night, 
they double checked it from their end and guess what they're bringing us a new one tomorrow <laughs> so that's the thing for the moment it's working i'm gonna try to get my vlog loaded and maybe the new one will be faster that would be nice all right i'll be back It's a lot of water down there or something. All right. I think we're headed towards home. We're done with our little hilly adventure. But it's been interesting. Tuesday, January 4th, 10, 18 a.m. Don't get excited. I've already looked at the phone calendar stuff. Like, hello. Um, what started out it was, was going to be sort of a quiet day with just one appointment with a foot doctor <laughs> has turned into kind of a busy day. I might get rained on. It's always a possibility. But I've got an umbrella in my pocket and I'm, we're going to walk over to the podiatrist's office. So, yeah, we'll see how this goes. I'll be back. Interesting day. <laughs> so as I'm trying to get to my appointment, my neighbor stopped just to say hi because she hasn't seen me in a bit. And we chatted for a couple minutes. And as we were talking, the roof guy drove by who wasn't supposed to be here for a couple hours yet. So I had to call my husband and say, can you take a minute? Because the roof guy's there. He just drove by me. Meanwhile, I still have to get to my appointment. Why does it feel mon like Monday on Tuesday? We got the new orthotics. I'm headed the wrong way. <laughs> they feel good, different, but good. Yeah, I like the way they feel a lot. Um, I think I need to adjust the one in the shoe a little bit, but yeah, they're different, but they're good, I think. Uh, the two chests will be going home because I got to wear them home, so. But yeah, we're gonna go home now and see if we can relieve Bob of some of the craziness that's going on at home. I'll be back. Fact about me, I love to read and I love to do puzzles, besides all things creative. So we started on this guy, New Year's Eve. Um, he's a little difficult. Anyway, we got a little bit of a ways and I just finished, well, for the most part, I have these pieces left, but the wings, the red and white stripes on the wings, that was hard. So I might work on it a little bit. I sorted the pieces by color just now. And I'm going to see if I can get a couple more pieces, then I'm going to stop. And I think Bob's going to pick it up later. But yeah, we both love to do puzzles. So anyway, it's a thing. I'll hey be guys. back. Good morning. It is Wednesday morning, January 5th. Helps if I take off the parking brake and put the car in reverse. Anyway, so we are headed out. It's just after 8 a.m. I have a physical therapy appointment this morning car is cold. The <laughs> car is cold. So anyway, we're going to go take care of physical therapy this morning and then we have to later drive to Portland International Airport and pick up my dad. So he's flying in from a visit with my brother in Southern California. So we're going to go take care of that. Those are my two things for today. Hopefully it doesn't end up being like yesterday where I end up with a whole bunch of other things. I haven't been able to do art in the art room. I've done art, just not in the art room, in like two weeks, maybe, week and a half. Like it's been a while. Like I've been doing art and cleaning in art room, but I haven't actually been able to sit down and like paint on my, at my easel or like it's just, it's been a thing because life is just busy. It's crazy. Anyway, so if you're like that, you're Turn not right onto Southwest 130.
Hey guys, all right, physical therapy is over. Scott and everybody else at Northwest Physical Therapy do a great job, by the way. If you are in the Portland area, they have a few offices, look them up. Um, all right, we are gonna head towards home. I do think I might stop at Dollar Tree and just poke my nose around. Um, they're supposed to be getting new merchandise in and or moving things up so they don't no longer cost a dollar. Um, and I don't know if mine it has actually done that or not, but I'm just curious. I might just go straight home. I don't know yet, but I guess we'll find out in a minute. Okay. I'm supposed to pick my dad up at the airport today. He's, kind of, like I said earlier, he's flying in for my brothers in California. Uh, yeah, he's stuck for more than two hours in Sacramento. So I have time. So I'm upstairs in the art room finally um doing some backgrounds in the year of my life journal um which is a journal scrapbooky type travel journal i used to do back when we could all travel i put um receipts and photos and different things for different events that happen or places i see or people people i go places i see people i see places i go holy cow anyway so I'm doing the backgrounds for that and I've got four days worth of stuff or four double page spreads worth of stuff I need to do. So that's kind of my art to do thing for the week. Um, checked on social media, took my blood pressure. Fun fact, I have high blood pressure and I am on lower medication than I used to because I've lost weight and I'm exercising, but still got to keep an eye on it. Um, anyway, my dad's flight's more than two hours late and yeah, so I ate some lunch, did some art. I don't have to leave until like two o'clock to pick him up because he's not gonna land until like three. So yeah, that's a thing. I'll be back. It is 9.32 a.m. Thursday, January 6th. I think. Pretty sure. Ooh. Anyway, I've been up for a little bit. I've already got the dishes done. We are making some fresh batches of homemade vanilla. And I've added new beans to the old batch. Um, the old batch being about 20 years old every little bit. <laughs> uh, sometimes it's five years, sometimes it's once a year. I lose track. Um, I take all the old beans out and put fresh beans in it and then top it off with fresh vodka. And so this is the old one. We'll leave it out on that counter for a few, uh, two weeks maybe, um, with the new beans in it. And we'll give it a shake once a day at some point when it gets dark enough. Look at all those yummy seeds floating in there. Um, when it gets dark enough, then you can, you can keep it out on the counter or you can refrigerate it. I refrigerate it. You don't have to do that. Um, and this is some fresh. I just put this in here last night. I cut the beans in half this morning. I usually cut the beans in half or I split them or both. Um, vanilla beans can be expensive. So depending on how much they cost, depends on how many beans I put in, to be honest. Um, I might order some more though um, and put more beans in those. We'll see how it goes. I also, um, I'm in the process of reorganizing my pantry with containers for storage that fit better in that space in this house. So I got a few more of those in. Um, I just do a little bit at a time and I took care of those this morning. I did the dishes. I've got laundry working. Answered a few questions on the socials. <laughs> and now we're gonna go upstairs. So um, I've got some stuff to do up there. So, and I also want to do some drawing in my main sketchbook, which I haven't done in a couple of days. We've been doing the daily doodly word stuff, but we haven't doing, been doing this sketchbook for a couple of days. So anyway, all of this today. No appointments today. I get to stay home. Maybe go walking if the weather lets up a little bit. We'll see. Yeah, yeah. That's it for right now. I'll be back. I got my journal all caught up and finished. Uh, well, finished. I got the pages that I needed to catch up on done in the journal. The one for my brother's wedding. We celebrated um, one of the kids, Brian's birthday at Betty Hanna in October. We also went on a family weekend to get away to an Airbnb in Cannon Beach. So I did that page. And then of course, 
um, Christmas, the Christmas page, um, which is big and I had to do flip outs on most of these because I've got stuff I wanted to put in there, but yeah, there you go. So yeah, um, those, the person who sent me that handmade card with the art foamy stamp, you know who you are. And yes, that card made it into my journal. Anyway, uh, yeah, so I got that done. Um, I think tomorrow I'm gonna work on the painting on my easel. I got the paints out for that. I think right now I'm gonna make a cup of bone broth, number one. Um, and then I think I'm gonna film a couple, of, well, at least one short video on how I decorate my daily drawing and sketch, uh, daily drawing doodle type books and also my sketchbook. Although I think I've shown that before. I think I'm gonna do that. I need to sort some stickers I bought and put them away. I don't know if I'm gonna do it for the vlog or if I'm gonna do it separate video. I might just put it here in the vlog because like, why not? All right, um, and if the footage is interesting, I'll cut it out in total and make it a separate video, like on the Patreon channel, the private YouTube channel, but uh, you know, something like that. Anyway, so that's next on the list. But first, I need a cup of bone broth. I'll be back. Most of the morning in the art room, sketching and decorating sketchbooks, and y'all saw some clips. It's a little bit drizzly outside, but I've been in the art room so long and over the desk so long, my neck is starting to hurt. So I need a break. Bob has uh, a Masonic meeting tonight, and so I'm going to take the opportunity when it's just lightly raining to go for a walk and get some steps in. I do have an umbrella just in case, and my pink jacket which is semi water resistant uh, I get asked a lot about the pink coat uh, not so much online but in person when I'm walking the neighborhood I've had this coat like oh, since 2006 maybe 2008 a long time I used to do the Avon walk for breast cancer and after doing my first one I realized I needed a water resistant coat because I walked in San Francisco and it didn't matter if it was July it was cold and rainy. And I found this one at like JCPenney on clearance. 20 bucks a hit. Anyway, it's lasted. <laughs> and it's pink. Who doesn't like it? All right, we're gonna go get some steps in and see what we can see and I'll hey be guys. back. <clears throat> Obviously we're in the car. It's 8.08 a.m. <clears throat> Friday, January 7th. In 700 feet. Having some winter storm issues this morning more so at my dad's house than at our house. He's under a flood watch and a level two evacuation warning. Um, we are having some problem with, um, we're under a minor flood warning. We don't really expect flooding. Um, although the creek is pretty high, um, but we have some gusty winds. So because so much of our neighborhood including our house, is near wild and open woods and wetlands. Um, yeah, kind of an issue. 
So we're keeping an eye on things. It's only supposed to be until about lunchtime today, so. Turn left onto South. working on this the whole time I've been painting this when it was initially black and white and now and this process to get to now it, it never turned out the way I thought it was going to do I like it yes I loved it as black and white I like it here there were there were times when I didn't like it but I do like it is it done I don't think so but we're gonna let it dry because at this point if I move it around anymore it's just gonna make mud so anyway progress I guess Time to clean up and do something else. <laughs> Maybe go for a walk if it's near end of work day for my husband. I don't know, we'll see. A quick back. walk and I got a few steps in. Got one picture, but it's dark out. It's too hard to get too many pictures. Um, we're gonna go out and get some takeout for dinner to the bar local mom and pop bar barbecue place, I think. And yeah, not family dinner night is tomorrow instead of tonight, so. We can just chill and relax, and I'm okay with that. Hey, right. everybody. Oh, I'm sorry. Good afternoon. It's 12.02. <laughs> Oops. Um, we've just had a lazy morning. We're going to go head out and run some quick errands. I've got to drop some books off at the library and pick up some groceries. Uh, we also spent the morning catching up on bookkeeping. Mostly that was him. And uh, bills. And bills. Yep. 
and um, we're thinking about buying some new sofas. We haven't bought new sofas since the 1990s. Uh, yeah. Early 90s? Yeah. The sofas we have are that old. Um, we could just get them reupholstered, but honestly, with the cost of labor and all that stuff, it would be probably not too much cheaper than buying a new one. I don't know. We'll see. Plus, we kind of want a different style. So, took some measurements, took some pictures today. We're not going to go shopping for them today, but we're ready when we are feeling up to doing that. And I think we found a local furniture place, furniture uh, manufacturer that can do a good quality sofa. So, bonus points. Anyway, I also got a little bit of stuff done in the art room and checked on social media. So now we're gonna go run our errands and it's brighter than snot out because the clouds are cleared, mostly. But you know, family dinner night tonight, but it's not at my house. So I don't have to yippee. do any, yippee, yeah. I don't have to do anything except go buy some salad and liquor. I was told to bring salad and liquor. Booze. booze. The son-in-law said bring booze. He didn't say bring drinks, he said bring booze. Yeah. All right, I'll be Not back. Our errands done, but this week's empty shelves, frozen pasta. Like there just wasn't any, any of it. There was none. <laughs> no frozen pasta. No frozen pasta. <laughs> so we made some substitutions. Yes, we like to cheat and do frozen meals. Like hello, so shoot me. It's they're easy. It's just the two of us. Anyway, mostly it's just him that eats it because I eat salad. Anyway, so we came back, had lunch, did our word brain game to exercise this up here. And now we're gonna go for a walk because we're going to the kids' house for dinner later. We're not sure we're gonna get any walking in, so we'll get some in now. Anyway, then go back to the house and I don't know, do stuff before we go to the kids. I don't know what stuff. We'll see, I'll be back. birds supposed to fly south for the winter including ducks ours never do they just fly from pond to pond so yeah I don't know all right we're headed home I'll be back It's Sunday morning, oh, Sunday afternoon, 1.15. I forgot to close last night's vlog. We got In two very points. late last night from the kids' house for dinner, but wow, what a wonderful we dinner we had. Blackened salmon tacos, it was wonderful. I need to get the recipe from Rebecca, uh, and it was a really good time, but it was late, we were tired. I didn't even get my drawing done, you guys. So I am gonna need to catch up on that later today, because that's a thing. Anyway, I also have forgotten the last couple of days to put the daily creative words up in the A Life of Barton Self-Expression Facebook group. I apologize, you guys. I will try to be better. I will endeavor to be better. But I got them caught up to yesterday, uh, to Friday this morning, and then I will do yesterday's and today's later today because I haven't done yesterday's pages yet. So anyway. Anyway, I'm on my way to an appointment this morning, but I'll explain more about that in the next vlog. You guys all stay safe, stay healthy, stay creative. Go out and do something nice for yourself because you deserve it. I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye, guys.